Hi, I'm Rich Denmark. I'm here to give you some tips on what it's like to have a beard as a diver and what to do when you're on a dive and you've forgotten to shave your mustache and your mask leaks. First things first, get yourself a mask with a nice thin skirt. So that way it's up as close as possible so you don't have to take all your whole mustache off. All you have to do is what I call the Bob Sherwood, where you just shave the top. Um, Normally you do this at home, but if you've gone to the dive site and you've forgotten, uh, what I like to do is keep a Leatherman on my dive kit because all of these tend to have a pair of scissors in them. So you bust out your scissors, trim out the longer hairs, a nice little M shape up top, so your mustache still looks normal, but all the hair is gone. And then I like to keep one razor with me that has a single blade on the top. All the five blades, all that stuff's great for shaving your whole face, but for just getting in precision detail, you just need just enough to get in there, clean it out, make it nice and clean, and your mask will get a nice seal again. Uh, barring that, what you can do is go to your Save a Dive kit and get some silicone uh, lubricant for your O-rings. Uh, you can get this in any hardware store, or you can go and get it from the dive shop in little tiny tubs, put a whole bunch of that in there, and your mask should seal. It's important to note that you don't want to use anything that is based with petroleum, like Vaseline, because it could actually eat away your mask over time. So I hope this helps you understand uh, uh, or prepare for a way to make sure that you've got a mustache on a dive. You can clean it up, take care of it, and still continue your dive. And make sure you look as good as this guy. Mm -hmm.